most of the top. We were a bit surprised by that snow crossing back there. It's a lot longer than it looks, and we didn't expect any. But we made it, and now we think we're headed that way. That looks like a knife edge. We may be walking the knife edge very shortly. This stuff is slippery and slidey. It slides down the hill after you walk on it. You've got to be really careful to watch your steps. But we think this is the trail because we can see trail ahead. Whew. Not the most relaxing place to be hiking. And here we are again, folks. Making our way across the snowfield. The rocks, they are a rocket. Here, I'll let you guys look at the view. I have to look at the rocks, I cannot look up. I gotta see where I'm going here. This section is kind of crazy. This is the easy part. That's why I'm able to pull the camera out. And I mean, truly, this is way easy. Even though it's a, you know, a vertical drop. It's okay, because there's at least some trail, and it doesn't look like it's falling away. And we see there's a hiker head, so they've lived either to get here from this side or the other. Who knows? We'll ask them when we get there, but regardless, they're still alive, right? So we should still be alive. As you can see the knife edge, we're going to go walk down and cross that trail down below there. I'm going to put the camera away. Just when you thought you were done crossing the last peak, you get to see what's to the north of you. Wow. More the same, but it looks like a little more down than up, so. Friends, this has been one tough day. We knew it was going to be a, a tough day because we were planning on close to 20 miles and we knew there was, you know, I don't know, 4,500 feet of climb and stuff, but we had no idea how tough the trail was going to be. It, uh, it's got uh, some pretty rough tread in some places. It's been fantastically beautiful. The visibility is just amazing. Hopefully we've been able to share that with you, but uh, it's been exhausting. 
I ate a double lunch. I'm totally sure I ate all those calories. They are gone. They got used. Up, here comes Top Rock. So I'm gonna hang up now and get on down the trail so we can get to camp here in a couple miles. We've reached our destination for the night. We're gonna stop here. You can see it is beautiful. Quite the view. This was a, kind of a surprise find. We were looking at other places and they were out in the open, not that good. Uh, but Exposed. Uh, they were exposed, but this one came along and really dark. Let's step back. <laughs> <laughs> it's exposed and uh, this one's got some nice protection around it, so hopefully we'll get a good night's sleep. Today was hard. It, it was, was hard, hard day. but it was a great day. It's the reason we're out here kind of day. Well, I'm not so, out here to slide down the sides of mountains. Well, no, we didn't, though. Well, that's true. We didn't slide down the sides. So. A lot of rocks did. <laughs> a lot of rocks did. <laughs> and we didn't slip down the snow. No. And what we saw was beautiful. <sighs> yeah. Big, yeah. big views for far distances and... A lot of good colors up close. So you, you're only, you had everything. You're only gonna get some of it because I took so many photos. Part of two top rock saying, dude, you gotta limit it, you it's, know. It's probably gonna be two two videos for this because there's no way. He thinks it should be two videos, otherwise yeah. it's gonna be, you know, an hour and a half and you know that's too long for we're, YouTube. We're an hour and a half later to getting here than I thought. That's true. The last So put it this way, the last at three point eight miles I took on enough water to basically do four miles in the desert. I ran out of water halfway through. Uh, we very, were walking very windy. Very, less very than a windy. mile an hour uh, through that section because it was, you know, it was risky. So we were being yeah. careful. So it took time. So yeah, we're here much later than we expected and exhausted. Yeah. So we're going to wrap this up. We'll see you guys tomorrow.